Yeah, thank you, Dottie and Jack, for organizing this, not only organizing this, but keeping our community of poets on target. Um, you know, to, uh, we're so isolated oftentimes that these readings are really significant to keep our vision of what our, our word is supposed to do in the world. Otherwise, we feel our words have no effect, uh, but together they have a very powerful effect. So thank you for that, both of you. Uh, to, uh, you know, this year is also the 70th anniversary, anniversary of the dropping of the bombs in Hiroshima and Nagasaki. And I often wonder, as we all wonder, when are we ever going to learn? When is it all going to stop? Um, wasn't that enough? No. Wasn't Chernobyl enough? No. Wasn't Fukushima enough? No. Abe is uh, activating the reactors all over again against the will of his people. And so we need to join in solidarity with the people of Japan because, uh, you know, they are the ones sitting right on it. And that water is coming to us. And there's been a die off of dolphins and mutated uh, plants and uh, marine life, everything. So I want to dedicate this poem to all the survivors and all of those who raised their voices against injustice, all kinds of injustices, evictions, you name it. A moment can never happen again. That is life's greatest sorrow. If you've ever been to a house and had to leave it, you will know how great your sorrow when you return to it. That is life's great sorrow, no matter how hard you cling to it. No matter how vivid the memory, no matter how powerful the feeling, a moment can never happen again. We mourn the good old days, but then we forget the names of our friends. We mourn the people of Tohoku, then we never think about them again. We mourn the people of Fukushima the way we mourn the people of Nagasaki and Hiroshima. They called us, their voices called from over the waves and their tears through, fell through empty clouds that drowned their tears. But they flew up like birds over the tangle of waves, over hilltops, valleys, lakes, schoolyards, buses, trains, factories, temples, over births, deaths, dreams, and regrets, over joy, laughter, and tears. Have you seen the flowers of Fukushima Two-headed daisies on one stem. One-headed daisy with two stems blooming over the graves, over births, deaths, dreams, and regrets, over tears, joys, and sorrows, over time, over tomorrow. Thank you.